So on the same day that it was reported Johnny Impact was done with Impact Wrestling, LAX is now also apparently done with the company and their contracts. Actually, we're running through August, I believe. But after the program at Slammiversary, um, they're apparently free agents now. So initially, it seems Impact had a priority to re-sign LAX to big money deals. But they it's rumored that they have offers out there from AEW and WWE. I think the smart money is that they would go to AEW if they were to leave Impact Wrestling. Because if you got the Lucha Brothers there, who, who you already know you have magic with, you have a Bucks, the Bucks there where you got to compete at the on the Jericho Cruise with. And they also have magic. You got SoCal and Censored, and they're putting a strong emphasis on the tag division. Whereas you got Impact, where I've talked about this a hundred thousand times, they ran through everyone so quickly. Over the course of the year, they won the title so many times. What can you do? What else can you do with LAX? So, yeah, kind of it kind of sucks to see him go. But at the same time, it's probably needed to give some of these new tag teams the opportunity to step it up. Now, when they initially re-debuted with the new members and Diamante was part of the group, like I was really into LAX. I really liked that female aspect of the group. She got injured. Um, even when she came back, they never really gave her opportunity to reintegrate into the group. Aside from one or two segments with Kingston, they were kind of teasing that she was going to be involved with the uh, feud with the OGs and everything. That never materialized. She was released. And, you know, what initially started off with Homicide in the group as well now came down to Conan and LAX. You know, talented group, but with LAX and the, bat and the clubhouse stuff. Because we got the clubhouse every week. On impact every week it was like a lot of the same same over and over and over and over and while they have always delivered you could tell and this is this is aside from Santana's injury but you could tell at Slammiversary that this was not a match where LAX went in there like hey we're gonna steal the show like we're gonna be with the company long term like it was one of those matches wrestled like hey we're done so LAX what are your thoughts on this? I will be around for 30 minutes to talk in the comments with you guys after this uh, video hits the channel. But LAX apparently is done. I would say it's pretty safe bet that they are done. And I don't see them going to WWE and going through the whole NXT system because, you know, AEW is now providing an alternative that's in front of a large audience and paying well. Like, there's really no reason to go over to NXT and do all that shit now. So... I think expect to see him in AEW. They did a shut up cat. They did a great job. <laughs> Sorry, my cats drive me crazy sometimes. They did a great job with Impact Wrestling. Uh, sad to see him go, but they did everything they could possibly do. If it's your first time here at the lounge, hit that subscribe button. Talk to you soon. Peace.